Hey guys, what's happening? It's your average table, and I got Dark Souls finally. Um, through a series of fortunate events, I ended up actually getting um, the PS3 um, from a friend, so I was actually able to get Dark Souls and all that. So, got this. Let's start up. Let's name you Dable. And you're good, and then you, and I'm gonna be the, uh, you have higher HP, but I think I'm gonna be the warrior, just cause you have, like, higher everything else, really. Um, gift, I'm gonna make it the master key, just because I've heard that it's really good. Uh, slim, doesn't matter, I kinda want, swept back, yeah, he, he, he's got flow, he's got flow. And then we got, what do we got? We got red yes done except done now I will be quiet as the uh, the thing happens the game the world was unformed shrouded by fog a land of gray crags arch trees and everlasting dragons But then there was fire, and with fire came disparity, heat and cold, life and death, and of course, light and dark. Then from the dark, they came and found the souls of lords within the flame. Nito, the first of the dead. The witch of Isolin and her daughters of chaos. Gwyn, the lord of sunlight and his faithful knights. And the furtive pygmy, so easily forgotten. With the strength of lords. Mighty bolts peeled apart their stone skins. The witches moved great firestorms. Nito unleashed a miasma of death and disease. And Seath the scales betrayed his own, and the dragon. Soon the flames will fade, and only dark will remain. Even now, there are only embers, and man sees not light, but only endless nights. And amongst the living are seen. Well, I'd say that the dark sign kind of sucks. I mean, I don't know what part of the body that was on, but I mean, when you have that on any part of your body, it's not cool.
Where the heck are we? Oh, this is Zombie Guy. Well, it's still going. Might be. It must be kind of boring in there. Well... I'm gonna go ahead and pillage that corpse. So, welcome to Dark Souls, everybody. Uh, I've played like around a little bit with some of the characters just to see what uh what they do, which one I like the best to start with. And I found that this guy I really do like. And I see this guy, and I'm like, holy crap! First of all, goddamn, I have a feeling that we're gonna be coming back here at some point. Maybe. Oh, I finally got the behind the back kill. Never gone in on that guy before. But these are going to be like uh, 10, 15, 20 minute episodes depending on when my video desyncs. So it's not really up to me. It's kind of when my Elgato decides to start messing up. Okay, excuse me, can you die? Thank you. And uh, if you. D I'm, I would be thoroughly surprised if you've never heard of this game or seen this game. If you don't know the currency, it's souls. That's the little white stuff I'm getting from the people, and it's the counter on the bottom right. And you can get like a butt ton of souls. Uh, bonfires where you heal. And that's really about as much as I know. I'm not, it's not that I'm not a fan of RPGs. It's just that I've never really had the chance to play a lot of RPGs. And uh, yeah. And then this happens. Yeah. Now, I don't know a lot. I've actually I've played up to the... Um, the second boss. So if that gives you an idea of where I am in the storyline, I've played up to like the guy on the bridge, if you know what I'm talking about. If not, uh, well, you'll find out in a couple episodes, probably. Um, let's see what we got here. I know how to lock on, too. That took me a while. It took me till I actually got the game to find out how to do it. I, um, I ended up borrowing, or not borrowing the game, actually using the game at a friend's house once and literally had no clue how to play learned in about or learned as in basic move controls in about like five minutes and then just kind of went at it and never knew that um your body takes the souls with you when they die and then all the good stuff happens and i'm really hoping i chose the key as my thing and oh i usually make it out of the way but you know what game that's all right I forgive you. But I don't forgive this guy. Ah, douchebag. There we go. So, we're gonna go over here, talk to this guy, and then... Like, f okay, well, I actually didn't mean to skip through all that, but, uh... The important stuff kind of comes over here. I think. Yeah. to the land of ancient glories when thou ringeth the bell of awakening the fate of the undead thou shalt know well now you know and I can die with hope in my heart so this guy's cool oh, one more thing Here, look at that light shining on him he deserves it an Estus flask an undead favorite I like how you spell favorite dude you're cool oh and this what else 
Oh, I got a key. I got a got a key. Okay, screw you. I don't care about you anymore. You're gonna die. Wait. Is that? That's the guy who dies. No. Now I'm really sad. I thought it was like a guy, like an enemy kept always like falling and stuff. And like just auto dying. Oh man, that's disappointing. I didn't know he killed himself. That's actually really sad. Oh. God damn it, dude. Pulling out my heartstrings. Come on. Bruh. Also, uh, countering, like that thing. Uh, most likely not gonna happen because it's like impossible for me. Like, watch, I'll try. And then. Oh, well, I did it, so, I mean, it, it's really effective when you can do it, and I'll probably try to learn at least, like, a little bit on how to do it, but, I mean, I can't, okay, I didn't, I didn't mean that. Okay, you know what, fine, fine, be that way, you're dead. Uh, this is flask up, now, let's go over here, take out this guy, and then we're on to our first boss. Um, if you've never played this game, I'm sorry I'm spoiling it a little bit, but the rest of the game won't be like that. Um, I just know what I'm actually doing for the first, like, three seconds of this game. Um, you weigh more, but you defend more. How much heavier? Or do I go with the heater shield? No, I'll go with the heater shield. I, may, I don't know. I don't really know if it's slower or faster, but it just kind of makes me feel faster. I guess that's what really matters. But the Asylum Demon, yes. When I first saw this guy, I remember, I was terrified. Well, not terrified, but like, so many deaths. Not even funny. Oh, boy. Oh, he missed? Holy crap. I was really lucky, actually. Oh, no. Yeah. No. Stop. Show that tush to me. Oh, come on. Stop flying. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. Do a little dodge. Do a little dodge. Oh, ow. Oh, boy. Oh, made it. Dead. Smoke the first asylum demon guy. Fantastic. So I think we're going to wrap it up here on that victory. Got a humanity, whatever that really is, I still don't kind of know. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Feel free to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.